I know that you've done this before. I just want to go through the steps of how you'll share it with me when it's done. So in Google Classroom, you have this word art link here. I do have a video reviewing all about Easter. Um, I'm hoping it'll inspire some of your words. You're also welcome to look at the Easter pages in your uh, workbook as well as reflect back on our Holy Week um, Google Slides. All of that will have some good um, inspiration for you for this project. So the link here um, will take you to the Word Art uh, website and you're going to click Create Now. I've already gone ahead and started. Um, you're going to adjust what words you would like. Um, you can change the color, the angle, the font. You can change the shape. I'd like it to be something reflecting Easter. You may choose whatever um, image you would like. And I do know how to spell cross. That's just all I typed in before it appeared. So just so you know. <laughs> uh, change whatever font you like. Um, I picked random just so that it fills the image, but you can decide what words you would like um, in which directions. And then last um, style that you have here. Um, I guess I should reference to for words, I'd like at least 10 words. I just started with three, but I'd like you to make sure you have at least 10 and I'll add that to the Google Classroom directions. Okay. Now that I have this done, um, you do press visualize and it will create your image um, with all the settings that you created. Um, and you can press it a few times, especially if you did random, it will make a different version every time. Okay, so I'm going to take my cross. Now that I have it done, I'm going to show you how to share it with Mrs. Brissett. So up here has a share button. You're going to click the drop down arrow. You're going to go down to link. Now I have this link here um, and when I click on this link it will take me to the document that shows my picture. So what I want you to do is click copy to clipboard. Go back to this assignment and I'll just assign it for now so I can show you how to make a comment. Okay, so now that you have this Easter art assignment, once you have once you have your um, link copied on your assignment, there's the class comment button. You're going to um, do a right click um, and click paste or uh, the control or your control V will paste it onto there. And you're just going to press send. And now I can go ahead and click on this and it will take me to the word art that was created. So when we're all done, all of our Easter arts will be here. Feel free to view each other's. Um, but hopefully that will be some clear, easy directions. Let me go through them one more time. So you're going to watch a video um, to review Easter. You are going to click on the word art to go to this website, you click Create Now, which will bring you to all of the settings, and you're good to adjust it with at least um, 10 words relating to Easter. Once you click Visualize, and you've clicked it enough times to where you like the image that appears, you're going to click Share, and the link is what you're going to copy to your clipboard and you're going to add it as a comment by doing command or control V. <coughs> I'm not going to do it a second time and you're going to press this post button. Okay. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to let me know, but I cannot wait to see all of your beautiful creations. Have a wonderful day, fifth grade.